Okay, first my hair is freshly washed, like straight out the shower, washed. Um, I'm going to apply this mixture of water, castor oil, and sweet almond oil just because my hair did dry a little bit. And of course, when my hair is dry, it shrinks. And I was kind of afraid that my hair wouldn't lay down, so I felt like my hair needed to be a little bit more dampened. So after applying that water and oil mixture, I'm going to apply this honey leave-in conditioner. Um, I forgot the name of it, especially since the label rubbed off completely. Um, it was a freebie in my uh, gift bag from when I went to the Natural Hair Expo last summer. So I will leave the name of that product down below. Now I'm just going to work on um, getting any snags or like little tangles out. I don't have many because I already um, detangled before I started recording but like I said my hair did dry a little bit so I just wanted to work on getting any snags out before I started to apply the gel. So next I'm working on my part didn't really want a straight part I like the curved part look a little bit better I just think it's a little bit more I guess it's just cuter to me so I'm working on that and off camera I did fix it a little bit later but this is just you know getting your part however you want it you can do a middle part side part straight side part curved whatever you can have no part at all it's completely up to you So this is my first time trying the Eco Styler Gold Gel. Um, I went to the beauty supply and it's kind of funny because I went to the counter, I was getting ready to pay and the cashier was like, oh, so you watch YouTube. I'm like, <laughs> of course I watch YouTube. He said, everybody's been coming to get this uh, gel. We selling out and I think I actually took the last little bottle off the shelf. So I wanted to try it. For one, it smells absolutely amazing. It's like, it's like almost like perfume. Like it smells so fresh, so clean. It has like a kind of vanilla type of scent going on, but it just smells so good. And honestly, I can't really tell the difference between the gold gel and the regular green bottle of eco styler gel but the scent is definitely different that gold gel smells absolutely amazing and also shout out to that um beauty supply store they actually let me put my business cards on the counter for other customers to pick up so shout out to them thank you now what i wanted you guys to really see is that in between each section of hair because as you can tell, I parted my hair in three sections just so I could get like a good, I guess, grip on my hair because like I said, it does dry fast and it does shrink fast. So I'm applying gel straight in the middle of my hair and then smoothing it out. I found this to really help get my hair to lay down instead of just applying the gel on top and then trying to brush and or comb it together to lay it down. Applying some gel right in the middle definitely made everything just come together. Again, um, applying my water and oil mixture, I sprayed that to the section of hair that I felt was a little bit dry. I felt like it was starting to shrink, just so I can get you know some moisture back in, dampen it a little bit, just so it's easier to work with. So as far as the front of my hair goes, I was pleasantly surprised that my hair actually laid down. As you know, my hair um, suffered a lot of heat damage when I was wearing my um, half wigs and I was applying heat. I just could not believe it, so I'm super excited. Let's 
Now you see me applying some uh, foam wrap lotion, lotion or whatever, some setting lotion. And this is just by Motions. I thought I'd take an extra step and uh, see if that would help me at all. Um, can't really tell if it helped or not because the gel pretty much laid all of my hair down. But I mean, it's an extra step. If you want to try it, go ahead. I've seen other ladies do it during their tutorials and their hair came out perfectly so I mean maybe it helps maybe it does it I don't know okay guys so this is pretty much how my hair slicked down and I'm pleasantly surprised I got a little baby knuckle you know I ain't got that much hair but it's still something something to be proud of so I was going to use the got to be glued gel, but I don't feel that it's necessary, but I did use my bed head um, spray and the silver bottle, I believe is the strongest hold. So it's a lot of alcohol. That's why I didn't spray too much. Now don't laugh at my Huey Baton scarf. Everybody and their mama had one one time in their life. So don't come for me. And that scarf still works and it holds my hair down. So I'm gonna go ahead and apply that. And then I'm gonna apply my uh, cotton bandana just so both scarves just stay in place. And I sleep pretty rough. <laughs> like if you trying to make me choose between beauty sleep and just sleeping good scarf laying next to me look i sleep rough so that's why i had to use two scarves so the hair that i'm using is um cuban twist so I couldn't find another squinchy or whatever, so I just used a rubber band, and I am wrapping it around my little baby knuckle, my little piece of hair, my little ponytail, and uh, I'm just going to literally wrap it around. Now, I did fix this off camera. I didn't realize that it was kind of lumpy when I was, um, uh, I guess, putting it on on camera. So I did fix this, and I really do like the way this turned out. This is my literally like my first time with a protective style with my own natural hair that I've done in years. I honestly didn't think that I would be able to pull this off, but I'm pretty excited about it. And I think I want to keep my hair in a bun on and off for a while. I mean, it's quick, it's easy, and it definitely makes getting ready in the morning pretty simple because I don't have to worry about my hair because it's literally gel down for life like this is probably 
gonna last me maybe a good week so yes thank you guys for watching and i definitely plan on doing more hair videos with my natural hair and more protective styles drink.